Welcome to this online lesson on standard components. Our key points for today. Standard components are parts that are used in many different products. It is much cheaper to buy a standard component than to make a small quantity of the part. Stock forms. Stock forms are standard shapes and sizes in which materials are available. These vary for different materials. To minimize effort, energy needs, waste and cost, designers normally try to use either a stock form or the closest size that requires the smallest amount of processing. Reasons for using standard components. Some types of component are used in many different products. These include fasteners and fixings to hold materials together, electrical components and mechanical parts. There are component, uh, companies that have production lines dedicated to just making these standard components. This means they can buy materials in bulk, getting lower prices, divide the equipment cost across millions of parts, automate the processes, use labor efficiently, ensure that consistency and quality of products is maintained. The standard parts can then be bought at a low cost by whoever needs them. These parts are normally available in a range of standard sizes. Designers normally take this into consideration when designing new products. Standard components in action. Mobile phones. Although there are hundreds and even thousands of components inside a typical mobile phone, many are commonly used in all mobile phones and many other electronic products. Electronic components and standard components such as resistors, transistors, integrated circuits, and many more are supplied by electronics manufacturers in their millions to the mobile phone manufacturers. Types of standard components. Used with paper and boards, clips, fasteners, rivets, sticky tape, and bindings. Timber-based products. Hinges, brackets, screws, nails, and knockdown fittings. Standard components used with polymers include caps, fasteners, nuts, bolts, and washers. Standard components used in fabric and textile based products include zips, buttons, poppers and press studs, velcro, and decorative items such as embroidered decals, sequins, and beads. Metals. Some of the components used in metals are nuts and bolts, rivets, hinges, and washers. And the standard components often seen in electrical items are resistors, capacitors, diodes including LEDs, transistors and drivers, microcontrollers, switches, and motors. Now for a quick test. Name three standard components that attach metal parts together. You could either have nuts, bolts, rivets, or hinges. Thank you for watching this short lesson on standard components.